Hey guys, it's Trina, Baby Shopaholic. I uh, just want to come to you with my first video of the year, probably my first video in years. Um, I want to do more videos and I want to be able to talk more, guys get to know me better, and then I can actually say a lot more than typing because I don't like typing a whole lot of words, so video is the best thing. But anyway, I'm here with a special announcement um, on a project that I'm working on, and the project happens to be a baby. Um, I am about 11 weeks pregnant right now with my second baby. So Peyton is going to be a big sister and she couldn't be more excited. She's like off the chain. So, and then, um, some other news. Well, I'll get back to the baby, of course, duh. But some other news, I'm also moving. So that's why you see all this junk in the background. I got moving boxes, but. So to add being crazy exhausted from being pregnant. I'm still in the first trimester. I haven't made it to the second um, just yet. Almost there. But I'm so tired. Like, I'm out of breath right now just telling you guys this because I've been so hyped up. So there's been a whole lot going on. Getting a new house. Everything. I'm very tired. Um, but I'm sure a lot of you, I know the streets was talking. Um, people were texting me every time I post a picture. Like, Trina, you need to tell us something? And I would be like, uh... I guess I just went ahead and tell people, you know, I cannot tell a lie. So I just would tell people, but it's like written all over my face. Like triple chin is in effect. The cabbage patch face is like on 10, on fleek. And like everything is just crazy. Like it's like a professor, nutty professor suit. Like I just put on a whole layer. And then you can see how tired I've been. Look at my nails. I haven't had a feel in like a month. Seriously, I'm supposed to be all... Fashion one. And look how chubby my hands are. Big knuckles and everything. Ooh. But anyway, I'm, I'm making it through. You know, I'm doing my thing. I'm trying to survive. But, you know, I finally put on a little face. I had a doctor's appointment. I had the ultrasound. I was able to see my little baby. Heartbeat was going good. Everything was looking good. Then the little legs were moving. I was like tripping that they have legs already. I don't recall that with Peyton. Because I think my ultrasound, she was a little further along. But... Little baby was pumping the feet, so I am going to find out the sex. I'm not playing that neutral stuff. No, I got things to do. You know, baby shopaholic mode is on fire, so I got to close the buy, nursery to decorate, paint, clothes, you name it, shoes, boots, whatever. So, you know, hoping, you know, if it's a boy, I'd be ecstatic. I know Mr. Wood, but he's just bracing himself to have another girl, and I'm okay with that. I just want a happy, uh, happy healthy baby. Just like anybody else. So I'm not too stuck on, oh, is it a boy or is it a girl? But, you know, I just wanted to be healthy. So that's the big news. And um, I'm going to try to document more of my pregnancy. I am high risk. I am on that other end of 30. So I'm one of the old ladies having a baby, which is okay. Um, and then I also have fibroids, which has already, like, blown me up. So I'm going to give you guys, like, raw on cut. So this is what's going on. Do y'all not see this? I'm only 11 weeks and I look 8 months like I'm about to give birth. This is 11 weeks for Trina with the fibroids. So the fibroids are kind of taking over the baby. But I don't know. That was fine the last time. I had a few issues. But other than that, everything went smooth with Peyton. So I'm used to it. So I'm going to be very big. No need to be talking about me because I will snap back. So I'm not really too concerned. You know, it's worth it. Bring a child into the world. If I have to be ugly for nine months, then so be it. But I will be a beast when I come back. I keep telling Mr. like, I'm going hard in the paint once I drop this baby. Like, I was playing all the mother years. Like, ah, we got to the gym. I'm going to do this. I'm going to eat right. No, I'm not playing. I'm getting back in all my clothes. I'm going to show out. I am going to show out. So I'm just letting you know it. Put it out there. Y'all got to hold me to it. Where y'all see me over here posting burgers and stuff on Instagram. Remind me that I said that I was going to show up and show out. So, that's what's going on. And so, I will be doing videos documenting the rest of the pregnancy as much as possible. See, I'm out of breath. Who Jesus be her. Uh, five hours or something. I don't know. But anyway, <clears throat> I'm also going to be talking about my new home. I am renovating. Um, we're doing a kitchen. And the house is just beautiful, so I do want to share it. I'm really not an interior person, but I will um, share little things here and there, paint colors. Because, I'm, you know, I do things to get by. I try to do things as easy as possible and cheap as possible to come to the home. Because I do like my money in my closet or Peyton's closet 
or my new baby's closet. So I'm not going to go overboard with decorating. You know, I'm going to do some paint. Um, but we are getting a new kitchen, and that is my project. That is my baby. Mr. Let Me Have Full Reign. So I am the contractor for the Baby Shopaholic family new kitchen. So I've been working on that, getting it installed right now. We don't have any walls, so I will share all that. So anyway, biggest news is that we're going to have a new baby to style. Aren't you guys excited? I hope you are. Peyton is super excited. So I'll show you some moments with Peyton as well. Her talking about the baby. She saw the ultrasound picture. She was so cute. She came home and saw the picture and she started drawing ultrasounds. Like, this is the baby and put the baby on there, wrote baby all over. It was so cute. I guess I should show it to you, but I think she gave it to Mr. But, so that's what's going on. Thanks, guys. I hope you guys, oh, subscribe to my YouTube so I can get my name together. So go ahead and hit subscribe, like it, whatever y'all YouTube people do. Please do it because um, I want to do more videos and I would love for you guys to go on this journey with me. Thank you.